Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? I'm back with some Silent Hill, as promised. I wanted to keep playing it. Let's go into it. It has been, I think, one or two days? What? And this is my first time playing Silent Hill, and I'm not using any guides, so... Uh, that could mean any number of things. <laughs> Here's what I do know about Silent Hill. You never want to fight anything. So. Ooh, yes. I'll take a flashlight. Can I equip that flashlight? Okay. Don't know if I have it. Let me see there. Is there still something here? Yes. Thank you. All right. What? Oh, <laughs> that, I'm like. Let me see. I think this pulls up the map. Okay. That doesn't tell me anything. Back it up. Back it up. Back it up. Back it up. Let's see. Anything else I can take in here? That looks like something. Hmm. Can't take that radio. Can I take this ketchup? No. Now I've made a very little bit of progress, but I am going to save. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Let's get into it. Can I leave? What's that? Huh. Radio. What's going on with that radio? You literally just checked and if it doesn't work, dude, don't pick up the radio. Don't pick up the radio. Don't pick up the... <laughs> uh, okay, am I supposed to find this thing? Oh, that's not good. Ow. How the fuck do I fight? Alright, wait one moment. Ah, stupid bird. Okay. I think I'm dead. No, I'm not dead. How do I fight? Alright, one moment. I'm almost dead. So I'm just gonna take a nice sip of my drink and look up. How the fuck do I fight? Aim R2. Okay. I guess it wants me to use the gun, right? To this place. Uh, I take it that I'm very much close to dead. Okay. And I'm out of eight bullets. Sweet. Give me the re. Yeah, okay, so I could have stabbed it. I feel like all I've done is messed up. Alright. Let me see. Get out of here. I hope that lady cop doesn't come back and is like, what the hell did you do? Nothing. This thing just literally came through the window. Where could Cheryl have gone? Guess I'll check that alley again. Dude, are you really going back to the alley? Okay. Let's see. Am I going straight? Yeah, okay. I'm going the right way. Hmm. Q. 
can't park here. Let me see how close I am now. All right. Let's come up here. Okay. Turn in. Can I go into any of these places? May as well check. I can back up. I got sick hops. Hello. Oh, Algernon. Like flowers for Algernon. I assume anyway. I don't know if there was a thing called Algernon before that. Let me see. Am I right here? Yeah. Oh yeah. Let's go into the spooky place. Anything in this trash can? Can I stab a trash can? <laughs> I can. Uh, good to know. Is that my radio? Oh. Shit, that means there's a monster nearby. Am I going the right way? I see it right there. Can I avoid it? Is the question. I feel like the answer is yes. Can you back up? Is that a dog? Gonna sneak. Wait for it. Turn its back. There's two of them? Yeah. Ah! Go back. Let me in, let me in. No! Okay. Oh, I get it, because it said beware of dog. Okay. Avoid it. Let's see, is there anything here? Wrong action. Stab the trash. No. Nothing in the trash can. Alright. Bam, back to this fucking place. Back to the weird camera angles. I think it's called a Dutch angle. Um I think that's what it's called. I remember in class, um, that specific angle, whatever it ends up being called. Ooh, yes. Um, my teacher told me you only use it when you want to dis distort a person. So you put something to the side to let them know that something's not right. Um, ooh. Sketchbook cover, this picture, it's me. <laughs> Are you sure? The first picture, oh, the Cheryl drew in her sketchbook that I gave her her fifth birthday. I was gonna say, dude, you have some low self-esteem. I thought I had bad, bad self-esteem. Apparently you got it worse. Is that a pipe? Yeah. Oh. Good enough for the mayor, Mike Hagar. It's good enough for me. Um, but yeah, my teacher basically told me, like, oh, it's meant to um, cause some kind of weird to school. Is it the Cheryl sketchbook? Hmm. She's at the school. Hmm. Alright, to the school. Oh, that's a ways away. I'll probably go back to the place and safe. Oh, we're in Bradbury Drive. Like Ray Bradbury, the science fiction author. Um, anyway, he told me that, and then uh, <laughs> when I went to go check our school to see, like, oh, this picture of this kid who's getting an education is at a Dutch angle. And then the kid was black, and I was like, hmm, that doesn't sound right. <laughs> that feels, uh, I don't know if it was a, an unfortunate, for, unfortunate foresight from the person who took that picture, but after learning what that kind of angle is supposed to mean, it's kind of like, ooh. I mean, it was a cool picture, for sure, but, shit! <laughs> Run! 
Running, 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 run. Bye, dog. Ah! Fucking bats. All right, go. Run. All right, we got this. They can't catch me. They can't catch me. I'm too fast. I'm too fast. They can't catch me. I can't believe I actually escaped that. Okay. Let's go back to the cafe and save. Good progress. Shit! <laughs> How many of these things are there? Alright. Let me check the quick real quick how close I am. The game almost feels like it's in protest not putting up that map fast for me. Oh, maybe it's because I'm injured. Do I have like some kind of way of healing? That's a no. I do not. <gasps> Duck and move. Duck and move. Alright. You gotta drive him. Drive him. Snake formation. How close are we? Drug and move, drug and move, drug and move! Okay. I'm safe, right? And just in case I've created some kind of horrible hellscape situation, I am saving a second save. That's the end of today's video, everyone. I hope you enjoyed it as I continue trying to figure out what the hell is going on here. And I guess find my daughter. Until next time, everyone. Goodbye.